Hello and welcome. This is a calculation video focusing specifically on displacement values brought to you by Greenlight Campus. As we go through the video, please press pause if you need more time to take notes or think about the information given. The definition of displacement value is the amount of drug that displaces one gram of base. This is important to know to ensure the correct amount of drug is contained within a defined quantity of a dosage form. In preparation of suppositories, where we mix the drug with the base and pour it into a suppository mould, the drug will displace an amount of the base. The use of displacement values in pharmacy practice in dosage forms includes suppositories, injectable and oral powders for reconstitution. Let's attempt an exam style question. You have been asked to prepare 200 suppositories, each weighing 4 grams. The suppositories are each to contain 200 mg active ingredient and the displacement value of the active ingredient is 2.5. Assuming you will make a 10% overage, what is the total quantity of suppository base needed, giving your answer to the nearest 5 grams? Pause the video now to attempt this question, then press play to see the working out and answer. Firstly, what information does the question provide? Each suppository weighs 4 gram and each suppository contains 200 mg active ingredient. And you have been provided with a displacement value, which is 2.5. When attempting a question, it is useful to highlight or underline any key points provided. The first step is to calculate the total amount of active ingredient needed. You would first need to know how many suppositories you require. You know you need a 10% overage, so the total quantity of suppositories needed for this batch is 220. Therefore, 220 suppositories times 200 mg of active ingredient gives you 44,000 mg, which is the same as 44 grams. Next, calculate how much space that will occupy in the total batch, taking into consideration the displacement value. You know the displacement value is 2.5, meaning 2.5 grams of active ingredient displaces 1 gram of base. Now calculate how much 44 grams of active ingredient will displace base by using cross multiplication. This gives you 17.6 grams. The final step is calculating the amount of base needed taking into account the amount of base displaced by the active ingredient. Calculate the total weight of the batch, which is 220 suppositories times 4 grams. This gives you 880 grams. So 880 grams minus the displaced weight, which we calculated to be 17.6 grams, gives you 862.4 grams. Don't forget to round to the nearest 5 grams, giving you 860 grams. You can also use the formula method to answer this question if you are comfortable doing so. With pharmaceutical calculations, there are usually several ways in which you can calculate the answer based on where you learn how to do maths and which method you prefer. Provided you consistently get the right answer, the method is up to you. Keep an eye out on our future calculation videos showing you different methods. Thank you for tuning in. I hope you found this video useful. Don't forget to follow us on Instagram and Twitter at Greenlight Campus for the latest updates.